Let me handle this. Alex, you know that's not procedure. My call. Alex, wait here. Sorry for all the fireworks. It's the only way I could do this. Do what, Steve? Bypass the encryptions you yourself wrote to help Styles? How do you know about the encryptions? By talking to your construct. Not going to your website and talking with you directly. Figured that out, huh? Yeah. Your construct contradicted you and told me about the presidential safeguards. That's what Styles thinks I'm doing here. He engineered those guys out of prison. Had Chang killed to help stage this elaborate ruse. All believing that with unlimited access to the world's information, he could end up the most powerful man alive. Can't stand the son of a bitch. So then what is this, Steve? You ally yourself with a man you hate, you stage your own death, you sell out a brilliant career for what? You're a bright boy, Alex. I'd have thought you'd have figured that out by now. In three minutes, there'll be no internet for Will Styles to control, because there'll be no internet. Stop it right there, Steve. Or what? I created it. I'll destroy it. This is bigger than us, Alex. This is for posterity. I thought the internet was our future. That it would bring us closer to each other in a way never before thought possible. But I was wrong. All it did was create endless opportunities for perversion and corruption, serving greed, lust, and all the rest of the seven deadly sins. It didn't bother you to kill a few people along the way. Even a dear friend, if you had to. That, my dear friend, is the price of right. Stop, Steve. I mean it. You won't kill me, Alex. It's not in you. I believed in you. I believed in your cause. But you're wrong, Steve. The end does not justify the mean. was dead set on making our agency obsolete. A Alex, Tony, if you're there, I'm OK. I'm on my way. Are we in time? I hope so. thinks I'm doing here. He engineered those guys out of prison and had Chang killed and helped stage this elaborate ruse, all believing that with 
unlimited access to the world's information, he could end up the most powerful man alive. I can't stand the son of a bitch. You better hope somebody gets here pretty damn quick and can tell me what the hell's going on. What, what do you mean we don't want to I can't believe it. I mean, now you're telling me Steve Day really is dead. Yes, sir. This was recorded no more than 20 minutes ago. All eight of the escapees, plus the two involved in the Chang bombing, are also dead. There was extensive damage to the White House, but it seems that the basic infrastructure of the Internet is intact and operating. How are our people? How'd they make it? We took some casualties, including Commander Michaels, who was shot. I mean, is he gonna be okay? Yeah, he's gonna be just fine. Alex? Hey. I got a warrant for Styles' arrest. Yeah, well, he ain't, uh, he ain't very happy. <laughs> I can hear that. Of course, my daddy used to say, when the rooster is raised in hell, he's damn sure been in the hen house. Mr. Davison, your daddy was a pretty smart man. Let me see we go get the rooster. Billionaire computer mogul William Stiles was taken into custody in connection with the siege on the White House earlier this evening. He denied any wrongdoing and claims when the whole truth comes out, he will be vindicated. The president praised the Net Force Division of the FBI for their courage and quick response time and commended Net Force Commander Alex Michaels for his service over and above the call of duty. Commander Michaels was wounded in the incident. He was taken to a local hospital and has been released. This is Megan Michaels for INL News at the White House. I wish he would have stayed dead. He'd have left us with a much better memory. Did, uh, Davidson have a chance to introduce you to the president, first lady? No. But I wish he could have seen the expression on Stiles' face when we issued the arrest warrant. <laughs> He'd have loved it. One wealthy, unhappy camper, no doubt. No doubt. Too bad he's not going to have a chance to spend any of that fortune, except on lawyers. I'm sure he'll have the best. I know I do. I got to tell you, you did a hell of a job. And I know that I, um, well, that it's been tough. But I couldn't handle it without you. Thanks. Now I want to do something that will make your mama very happy. Let's get something to eat. After you, Commander.